Hello, my name is Anabin and today I would like to sh show you um, HTML5 support in NetBeans. So uh, what I usually do, I use the HTML5 application for implementing uh, CSS, JavaScript, HTML, HTML5 applications and actually all my uh, websites. Um, so, and the first screen, there's actually no surprise, it just asks you for, for, for name, but then you can choose either um, um, a template, oh, sorry, you can choose a uh, online template or a local one. So you can just choose, you know, which, which template to expand. But uh, I would say more interesting is actually the next screen. So first, what you see here is a, a collection of uh, popular JavaScript and CSS libraries. And I would like to choose one of the most popular one is called Angular. As you can see, it is not the recent version. And the reason for this is because I never updated this. So if I would click here, it would go to CDN, fetch the um, newest version of Angular. And I think the recent one is the, um, one uh, version 1.3.4.6. Uh, and in, uh, in NetBeans is 1.3.4. So I can choose this. And of course, um, I'll just pick, for instance, I uh, normalize, which is um, CSS library, which just resets all the layout. Very useful one. And I can even choose where to put the libraries. So uh, um, X folder. And what will happen, it just created a screen project with a folder Angular, with the selected Angular files, and uh, folder normalize for the CSS file. And of course, uh, the project is very clean with only minor dependencies on NetBeans. In fact, I never check in the NB projects to, to Git, so I ignore it. Um, it. I think it's even ignored by default. And this public HTML is fairly is uh, fairly basic, or, or, or I would say standard. So this is the root of the, of the page. And we, we could, of course, launch the page as well. Just say run, and it will open the page. Okay, thank you for watching and see you at one of upcoming workshops, conferences, um, projects. And if you like, come to Munich Airport. Um, we spend the whole day building and explaining HTML5 applications, responsive design from Java, Java E perspective. Thank you for watching and bye.